Donkey Titan Maniac just flying at them. And speaking of flying at them, that, my friends, is a flying fish. My friends, Banshee has done it again. He's selling something that is, in my opinion, slept on and incredibly special. That's why he's the MVP! That's why he's the GOAT! If you enjoy these little tips from your boy, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Today, he's selling the only 13 zoom two burst sidearm in the game, the brass attacks. It is a void sidearm, and it has the two perks that were meant to be together, surplus and wellspring. Surplus gives you stability, handling, and reload speed, depending on how many abilities you have active, and Wellspring gives you ability energy for every kill you get. The best guy around. What about the people he murdered? What it's murder? So Look at the stats on this thing with surplus times three, guys. Look at it. It's a stat monster, and it has almost 18 meters of range. Only two sidearms in the game that can get more range than this weapon. That would be the Drang, and that would be the Buzzard. Now, in order to get a Drang with that much range, you need to fully craft one. And if you don't have five red borders, then you're kind of out of luck. In fact, the only way you're going to get a good Drang is if Banshee sells one. And he's sold a few recently, but they've never been very good. Now, the gameplay is going to show you. I'm not just talking a big game. I'm showing you in the gameplay. This thing has almost 18 meters of range. And it's a two burst sidearm. It hits like an absolute truck. I'm in my pain with his fingers. Not as hard as that Hawk Moon, though, mind you. Sometimes that'll happen. We're gonna fly on in here, smash that guy in the back, kill him, get a little orb, get a little tangle, and we are good to go. Watch this. He's gonna come up there. Wait for it. Wait for it. Bang. Not ready for this gameplay, brother. You're not ready for this one. You are not ready either, mate. It's disgusting. Here's the big difference. In order to get a buzzard with this much range, first, you're gonna need to get very, very lucky with RNG, right? Like that guy got unlucky with RNG as the spiders assaulted him. Then you're gonna need to grand Grandmaster Nightfalls pretty much all day to get a good roll. We don't all have the time, the means, or the desire to do that. You can simply go up to Banshee and pick up this sidearm for doing literally nothing, and you have a sidearm that basically has just as much range. Granted, it's in a different archetype, but it's still one of the best sidearm archetypes in the entire game. It hits like an absolute truck. Now, Surplus is an insane perk, but especially insane if you're going to play on Berserker Titan, like I like to do, aka the big green donkey. Why? Because it has three melee charges. So even if you just had your melee charges up only, you'd be at surplus times three. You essentially have five abilities to work with, five ability charges. Oh, do you see that dodge on that rocket though? Whoa, 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 hello, hit reg. Hello, destiny hit reg. Insane. So basically, this is one of the best subclasses, if not the best subclass, caught him on the line, by the way, to get the uses out of surplus. Wellspring will feed ability energy into your abilities that are not up. So these two perks have like an insane level of synergy with one another. Wellspring on its own, not necessarily the best perk. Wellspring with surplus, two peas in a pod, my friends. I Can we win the league? Who's we gonna win the league? Yeah. Boost me! We're Arsenal! We're fucked. Ouch. We were not two peas in a pod there. He slapped me up real good. He really did. <laughs> he was not having it. He straight up told me, I do not have the facilities for that one big man. Speaking of which, do you have the facilities to smash that like button on this video? If you haven't already, make sure you do. We're going for something special here. Will it work? Won't it work? We'll find out. But we sent the colony to go and colonize some guardians and it didn't work, but that's okay. That's okay. We've got our super. So we're going to use that. Oh, he popped his well. Well, 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 I'll eat you alive, boy. Well, he's running. Oh my God, he's legging it. Oh my God, he sold his breeches. Where are you going, fella? Stop running, man. Stop running, mate. <laughs> my man was legging it. He was legging it, but he couldn't leg it far enough. And if we had bullets in our magazine there, we would have taken him out as well. And that would have been a glorious finish. It was a glorious finish all the same. So yeah, now that we've gotten out of the way, obviously, you know, Drang and Buzzard are better than this. But apart from that, there aren't any other sidearms in the game that can live up to this. Simply because it's one of the only sidearms in the game that has 13 zoom. The other sidearm being Drang, obviously. Now, the Buzzard doesn't have 13 zoom, but it can drop with Rangefinder. If you get Rangefinder, if you get a Range Masterwork, if you get all range perks, then yes, the Buzzard will outrange this. Only by like half a meter, mind you. Not much more than that. So as you can see in the gameplay, we are being a bit of a donkey right now with Colony doing absolutely nothing. But spoiler alert, there's a special Colony kill coming in this game. And if you haven't hit like, it will make you hit like. I promise you that. I promise you that. 
Now, the interesting thing with this sidearm is it's a two burst. So in my opinion, it's one of the most forgiving types of sidearm in the game because it's just really, really easy to hit those crits. And when you're hitting those crits, basically, if you want a tip with this weapon, aim at their chest, vertical recoil will kick up to their head and you will basically only get two bursts with this gun and when you do you're getting a very very competitive time to kill as well as landing a lot of flinch on your opponent because it's an aggressive type weapon and aggressive frame weapons tend to hit harder and flinch harder so even though my man had a immortal right there i was still able to flinch him out and get the damage that i needed to get the dub and as you can see, we got absolutely annihilated by the hand cannon. Sometimes that'll happen. Now we're flying back in for redemption, mate. That's my heavy ammo. It's got my name on it. And I will take that to the bank, mate. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, yes. We're going to lob that at him. He didn't do any damage. But we're going to go for something special here. I want to get someone on the line. And then I want to hit them with colony. That is the goal here. That is the goal. And here it is. Nowhere to run and nowhere to hide. The no look kill. I'm just going to run away and let the spiders do their work. That, that, my friends, is what it's all about. You know what I'm talking about? Taking the trolling to another level. World Championship trolling right here. Elite level. That's why I'm an elite guardian. Actually, I think I'm a veteran, actually. What, what are you guys? What rank are you? Let me know in the comment section. If you're anything higher than seven, I will be making fun of you because, you know, team six and seven for the win. You see that guy? He had a target lock immortal. We traded with him. That should give you an idea of the fact that this gun is a sleeper weapon that can actually hang with other guns. And like I said, it's got surplus, which in my opinion, oh my God, hold up, wait. Okay, that was a prank. That was a prank. Yo, yo, yo I'm only, oh my God, bruh, I don't want to talk about it. In fact, you guys didn't see that, okay? That never happened, all right? You tell anyone that happened, well, I'll be coming for you. You know what I'm saying? A stern word in the post for you, mate. Speaking of which, we've got a stern little spider for this fella. You know what I'm talking about? That is how we do it, mate. Another low look kill. Call me Roberto Firmino. If you know, you know. Make sure you smash that like button. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, guys, Banshee has this weapon for a very, very limited amount of time. So I wish you luck in getting it. If you didn't already turn on those notifications, make sure you do. Also, there'll be another video coming out tonight on Zerd's inventory. By the way, if you haven't already, drop me a follow on Instagram. I'd really appreciate it. We're trying to hit 10,000 followers on Instagram. So if you could help me hit that goal, I would really, really appreciate it. Check out my sponsors as well. Evolve PC, Battleweaver Customs. Join the Discord server. Come over to the stream. Do all of the things. All of the links are down below in the description. If you want more from me, the description has got you covered, my friends. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.